Hey guys, uh, it's SYF2000 again and I'm um, back and this time is a review of the 118 Autowatt Lamborghini Aventador uh, LP700-4 anniversary, 50th anniversary in the matte black color which is the Nero Nemesis So we're just gonna start from the front I hardly do reviews because I'm not good at it so I'll just briefly give you guys like a simple look through and Actually, overall, the car has not much problems, but I just noticed this gap here, if you can see the mirror, I mean the side windows, yeah, didn't notice that previously, but not that big of a problem. Okay, so from the front, we got this LED lights. It actually reflects light pretty well if you're facing like a light source to it. You see the little LED bulbs. Very nice white paint in the light. And then you see a Lamborghini badge. So in the front there are vents which I don't think you can see but they're actually you can actually see through them if you can tell. Side, the wheels. You got the brake, this and orange or yeah orange brake calipers, which is Lamborghini Avent. Is it Lamborghini Aventador? I can't see. Can't see that clearly, but with the Lamborghini badge, LP seven hundred dash four. And you see the vents, they are actually you can see through, if you can tell. But the lighting is a bit bad. Yeah, it's yeah, see through. And then the top, the color is nice. Like overall, painted well overall. Like there are no slight, like meta metallic, base metallic paint or whatever. It's just. Painted well overall, and the whole body is covered with equal amounts of paint. And the side vent here, you can see carbon, very nice detail. The carbon is very realistic. And then the back again. These brakes and brake calipers goes very smoothly. 50, uh, 50, the 50 batch, yeah. And I'm not sure, I think, I don't think you can tell because the light is like shining too strong, but actually, it's also see through this are mesh, it's not a big plastic piece, so you can actually see through. And there, it's just like at the back, there are just some radiators and stuff. So you got a chrome tip exhaust, four different exhausts, and Ventador 50 is batch, Lamborghini batch, very well replicated. You got the tail lights with the op. With, with each like bulb or whatever color in nicely very realistic and then moving on to this side same thing but the gas cap is here you can see the vents the carbon fiber detail very realistic like stands out from the normal matte black paint So another LP hundred dash four batch here. Sorry, uh, if you can't see the mesh, I might need to change the camera angle later on. Okay, so now take a look. 
on the passenger side the door swings up mechanism is very good but sadly my driver side is a bit it's a bit like unsmooth and then it stays stuck here because the, it's just one of the few problems after I before I got it so I just push it up and then it bounce back up so at the beneath you'll see the Aventador sign again so the interior you can see the dashboard you see the aircon vents there are the nice orange stitches that goes around the dashboard steering wheel you can see the brake and the accelerator the gas pedals the seats are in a bright orange color and for the doors you can tell that it's like some replicator orange leather with the silver handles very nicely replicated so from the passenger side we're gonna get to see it clearer so waiting for it to focus so you can see the those like racing gauge or whatever the speed the how to say the speed dials and everything yeah it's actually a carbon pattern here you can tell from above yeah it's carbon so it's very nice seat belts replicated nicely so I'll move on so actually the side mirrors are so it's actually very flimsy because I think the previous owner broke it and he didn't know so I glued it back on it's still a bit loose but overall replicated nicely and from the, the front I'll usually open it by turning it upside down because I don't want it to I don't want to injure it I mean like damage it <laughs> sorry so neat there we go okay so for the front you can see there's actually paint damage like the paint is scratched off this usually happens i saw a lot of reviews and people say this always happens so i guess it's because when you close the hood down sometimes if you close it too hard yeah it will just hit this area so this there will be paint damage So there's nice felt, very realistic carpety feeling. You can see these hinges very nicely replicated. This movement. You don't you don't see this in any diecast, only like auto art and some rare ones, some expensive ones. You see the way it works. Yeah, very nicely replicated and modeled. So now we'll take a look at the most expensive part that Autoart has put into this model which is the engine so I'll lift this up and the rear spoiler you can just pull it out and drag it back so that's the engine see a batch V12 Lamborghini batch on the cylinders or whatever the intake no <laughs> sorry but I, I, I'm not very good with engines but it's much deeper in real life because you can't really tell through the camera and you can see the springs the yellow springs suspension but Sadly, this model, I think this model offers suspension, but it's very rigid, so you can't really tell. So again, you can see through the mesh. It's not just one plastic piece, it's a whole engine mold. 
with different parts and then you got the spoiler so I'll just put this down one thing that is nice about this model is that the engine cover the glass that covers the engine is bluish in color I really like that touch like it's not just plain so just gives the car a nicer look so I'm just going to leave the spoiler here because I like it that way. So this is my simple review of the 118 Autowatt Lamborghini Aventador 50th anniversary in the Nero Nemesis color. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and sorry if I'm not that good in reviewing stuff. I'm just, I just prefer unboxing but I want to show you guys this car so that you know, so you can see and know what you will get when you buy this model. So thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.